tonight's video is of course dedicated to Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II. God rest her soul. May she rest in peace. It's fair to say that last season West Ham United went on quite a journey in the Europa League. And tonight David Moyes' hammers will aim to make the perfect start for yet another seemingly tough quest for European success. This time in the Conference League, they host Romanian giant Stour Bucharest. European night return to the London Stadium. Here we go. And there it is, lurking somewhere in the distance is the London Stadium. We are joined by Hardcore Hammer tonight, Jamie. It's the biggest one of them. Europa Conference League predictions today, lad. What are we going for? 3-0 West Ham. Same as me. Now let's get in this place. And take a look at that around half an hour before kickoff. Stour Bucharest are in town tonight. The away and down there. Over 3,000 crazy hardcore Romanian ultras packed into that away end tonight. So they are some crazy, crazy lot. We'll see a lot more of them very, very soon in this video. So stay tuned for that. Subscribe for more content just like this. If you don't do it in the next five seconds, you're an absolute mug. Of course, tonight there will be a minute silence remembering Her Majesty the Queen. God rest her soul. Here come the teams. No rendition of I'm Forever. And the teams are out. No rendition on the speakers in the stadium of I'm Forever Blowing Bubbles. There's still some people singing it tonight, especially down there in between the home and the away end. Kickoff is imminent. Loads and loads of Romanians here tonight. You can just tell they are all here to watch Stour play. 3,500 of them in the away end, sold out in just 20 minutes. I've just been told from one of the Stour fans around me. Incredible support. There they are. Bring on the match. London, West Ham's European campaign begins tonight. West Ham line up for their corner, but in the background, look at that absolute party in the away end. Both tiers jumping around. Could this finally be the opening goal? No, it cannot. Just under half an hour in. This has been a game very, very few on chances for either side. However, the physicality of this game is through the roof. And the away side, Stour, dominating on the physical side of this match. Still goalless. Next to no action so far. We're hoping for a goal. Could it be here? Could it be? Very nearly, the Stour fans nearly started celebrating. And I've got to say, that is by far the closest either side have come to breaking the deadlock. What a chance. 
Oh my goodness. Oh my God. I do not believe it. All kicking off there. All kicking off somewhere around there. One nil to Stour Bucharest. Oh my God, it's about to kick off in the home end. I can't speak anymore. Stour fans absolutely everywhere in the home end. Only a couple celebrated, however. I think they're getting kicked out. I, I'm shocked. I'm, I'm so shocked that I missed the goal. It's one nil to Stour Bucharest. They love it. Crazy. I've got to say, this Stour defence has been absolutely exceptional. Every single West Ham attack is just clear, clear, get rid of. They are unstoppable tonight. So big credit to them. They, in my opinion, have been the better side. They've created something out of nothing, obviously, with their goal. And they are defending and stopping away every single West Ham attack. And they come again. The Areola clears right at the end of this first half. Stour are surprising me. And there is half time. West Ham United nil. Stour Bucharest won. That was not the most exciting 45 minutes of football, to say the very least. But the Romanians go in ahead of the break. Second half, moments away from kicking off. Huge, huge triple substitution for West Ham at half time. David Moyes is going for it here. Bowen, Bowen, Antonio, and new boy, the Brazilian Magnifico, as they're starting to call him round here. Lucas Paqueta, all on for West Ham. They are going all guns blazing in this second half. Could they put two, three, or four past Stauer in this second 45? Or will the Romanians hold strong? For another half let's find out there we go we could be about to find out it's a spot kick to the hammers deservedly so that was a very very strange clash i think it was between antonio and the stour goalkeeper i'm pretty sure it was it's a stonewall penalty in my eyes it will probably be Antonio, Bowen, Paqueta, one of those to take the spot kick and hopefully for this lot round here, draw West Ham level. And I think it was actually Maxwell Corne. Forgot he was on the pitch, to be perfectly honest. Whatever that injury is, it does not look good in the slightest. I wish him well. All the Romanians around me filming this one too. Jared Bowen to put West Ham level. Surely. It's got to be one all now. Surely. Yes! What a spot kick. There we go. The Hammers back on level terms. The London Stadium is satisfied. After that, straight into the roof of the net. And a roar around this place. A sense of satisfaction and relief. West Ham won, Sour Bucharest won. 20 minutes to play. Is there still a winning goal left in this one? There must be. There must be. How on earth is there not? Did you see that? Lemonek. Surely, ah, oh, the goal is coming. I'm telling you, this winning goal for West Ham is coming. Can it be here? Can it be here? Yeah! Yes, it can! I told you! Just like that, the London Stadium erupts. 2-1 to the Hammers. And you know what? That really will sign, fill and deliver the three points to them in the Conference League match day one. They take a very, very well-deserved lead. Stauer have had their moments. Emma 
Emerson scores his first goal for West Ham United. And actually, a pretty damn important one it was to quarter of an hour to go. The Hammers finally take the lead. Well, you just knew that was going to happen. You just knew. Stour fans getting kicked out. I've never seen anything more inevitable and obvious in my entire life. Last push for a third. group game for West Ham United. Mikel Antonio seals the deal. Those last style fans, they don't give a shit. Let's be honest, they do not give a shit. Antonio, West Ham 3, style 1. Game done and dusted. Full time! An eventually comfortable night for the Hammers, somewhat overshadowed by the very sad death of Her Majesty the Queen. May she rest in peace. I will see you all very soon.